In this video, we will explain the audit trail function, how to turn it on, and how to access the audit trail data for review. To start, navigate to the menu screen and then select the security icon. Once done, we select the audit data and notice there is no data in the audit table. We select the audit tab to enable the audit trail. Below, you can adjust the settings for how many records to store in the audit table. 2,000 to 30,000 records can be stored in a first-in, first-out basis. Next, we select the settings table and enable the security function. Here, we enter our administrative password and select OK. We will make a few changes on the unit in order to create audit data. First, we will log in a user with the NFC tag. We'll select a recipe and load it to the unit. Now, we will log the current user out by navigating to the menu screen and selecting the logout icon. Now that this user has been logged out, we can log in a new user by NFC card. Navigate back to the menu and select the security icon. To review the audit data, select the audit tab. In this screen, you can access the audit data with all the functions we have performed. Here, you can filter data by operator, date and time, and activity type. You can also export the data to a CSV or XML file onto a USB key.